Hello and welcome to Mission Science Workshops How to Build Your Very Own Self-Watering Terrarium So, what do you need to build your terrarium? First of all, you will need an empty tennis ball container with lid For measuring, you will need a small plastic glass like this and this will be used to measure the sand, soil and water. We have a selection of beans and also some grass seeds. And that's it. That's all you need. Let's get started. First, take a glass of sand and pour it into the bottom of the tennis ball container. You can even it out by gently shaking it or lightly tapping it on the table. Next, Pour two glasses of soil over the sand and try to pour it evenly over. It's really important at this point that you do not mix the soil and the sand. Next, take a bean, any bean, and drop it gently into the tennis ball container on top of the soil. Take a cupful of soil and pour it over the bean. Make sure that it's well covered. Pour a glassful of water evenly over all of the soil. Okay, we're nearly there. One of the last things to do is to take a small pinchful of grass seeds and sprinkle them evenly over the soil, like so. The last thing to do is to put the lid on your terrarium. Make sure it's on good and tight. And then all you have to do is put it in a warm, sunny place and watch it grow. Here's examples of two terrariums that we've made earlier. In this first one, the lid has been taken off, and as you can see, the flower is growing out. If you do this, be warned, you have to water it yourself. Whereas this second one is an example of the one that we have just made. As you can see, the plant is growing inside. It is self-watering and doesn't need to be taken care of. Thanks for joining us today, and we hope to see you again soon. Bye!